These prayers, revealed by our Lord as His petitions to His Heavenly Father during His Passions, were dictated to Barnabas for us to pray daily. Prayer to Vanquish Satan and His Agents Jesus said, There is no need for you to fear those numerous populations of the enemy, children, Simply offer the wounds, pains, and blood of my left hand for their downfall. You will see them disappear like ashes. I assure you, many kingdoms of the enemy will disappear in the twinkle of an eye. Pray it and teach it to all men. My precious blood will save. All you great number of enemies of the holy death of my master jesus christ on the cross of calvary the prince of darkness and iniquity the father of all liars i stand on the death of my master jesus christ and offer his pains wounds and the precious blood from his left hand to the eternal father for your downfall your destruction and your scourging Amen. Precious blood of my Master Jesus Christ, reign in me and in the lives of all men. Amen. Prayer for the protection and unity of the flock. Jesus said, My children, whenever you say this prayer, you are making the hour of my kingdom on earth come sooner. Through this prayer, my Father will let it come down soon, the hour of the second Pentecost, when my prayer will be fulfilled that all shall be one. All who carry out this devotion will rejoice greatly when my kingdom comes. I will protect them always. Eternal Father, I offer you all the wounds pains, and the precious blood from the sacred feet of your Son, our Lord and Master, for all your children who are wandering like sheep without a shepherd in this terrifying forest. Protect them against wild predators and give them peace that they may be one and united in the same way as the nail held fast the feet of my Master and Savior Jesus Christ. Amen. Precious of Jesus Christ, reign forever. Amen. Prayer for Refuge in the Sacred Sight of Jesus Christ Jesus said, My children, these evil days will swallow many souls. That is why I teach this mysterious prayer to you in order that you all might be saved. My sacred side is for open for all men. Pray it and make it known to all men. All who teach this prayer to others will be protected. I love you all. Run for your lives. O loving Father, God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob, who protected the Israelites of old, in his holy wings, in the dryness of the cold and hot desert, I offer you the holy death of my Master and Savior, Jesus Christ, for the protection of your people who are scattered all over the world. May the blood and water wash and strengthen, save and cleanse us, that we might find home in the sacred side of your Son, which opens for all men. Amen. Sacred side of Jesus Christ, be our homes for safety. Amen. Prayer for release from ancestral curses. Jesus said, My children, pray it and make it known to the whole world. All who are under curses and constantly say this prayer shall be free from their curses. Any family that is suffering from the curse of sins made by their forefathers and make 144-day novena through this prayer 
will be freed. All who break a covenant and who are supposed to die shall be saved and also will be released from their curse if they constantly say this prayer and repent. Eternal Father, you are the only immortal God, God who is love, merciful, and kind. Look at your only begotten Son, Jesus Christ, and have mercy. I offer you the pains of his scourging at the pillar, his wounds and blood for all your people who are living under the weight of the curse. Due to the sins of their ancestors and their disobedience for breaking the covenant they made with you, may you set us free through the scourging of your Son, heal us through his wounds, and save us through his precious blood. Amen. Precious blood of Jesus Christ, release us from curses. Holy wounds of Jesus Christ, heal our wounds by your scourging. Seal us. Amen. Prayer for the Sustenance of the Faith Jesus said, When I was about to leave my people on earth, my agony grew greater when I remembered their unfaithfulness. I also remembered the period that is coming is terrible and fearful, that many will betray me like Judas while others will deny that they know me. Children, pray this prayer always for faith and make it known to the whole world before the perilous era comes in full force. If you have little faith, even as small as the mustard seed, you will overcome this period. This mysterious prayer is powerful. Teach it to the whole world. I love you all. Omnipotent and omniscient God, God of Elijah and of prophets, look at the sacred head of your only begotten Son and have mercy. Arise and save your people. I offer you all the shame, the pains, the wounds, and the precious blood from the sacred head of your Son for all your children who are living in these perilous times. Strengthen our faith through the mockery of your Son, Jesus Christ, and save us through the precious blood from his sacred head. May we do the sufferings of your Son, Jesus Christ, learn to suffer in you and die in you. Amen. Holy torches of Jesus Christ, increase our faith. Amen. Prayer for the Manifestation of the Divine Will Jesus said, My agony grew worse than worst when I entered Gethsemane. I look at my people and saw that they were asleep while the enemy was fast approaching and gaining ground. My agonizing heart broke out with these words, Why are you sleeping? Can you watch with me even one hour? Pray that you will not fall into temptation. When I knelt down again in prayer, the burden of my death weighed me down. Father, take this cup away from me, but not my will, rather yours be done. Finally, I look up and pray to my Father, thus make it known to the whole world. For the reign of my Father on earth. Eternal Father, you are the creator and author of life. You love the world you made. That is why you sent your only begotten Son to come for its redemption, so that your kingdom will come. Look upon your Son and rise up in your throne. Raise your right hand and save your people. I offer you all the sufferings, pains, and deaths of your only begotten Son, whom you love, for your triumph and reign on earth. May you, through the precious blood of your Son, make a new covenant 
and bring all your children back to your holy will. Amen. Precious blood of Jesus Christ, reign forever. Agonizing Jesus Christ, thy kingdom come. Amen. Prayer for endurance through the coming chastisement. Jesus said, My children, pray that this period you are living in now will be shortened. Pray also that your faith will not fail. Be on your guard. Be alert and watch always. How many of you will fight and drive back my adversary, conquer and be bring the captives home? My children, learn this prayer and pray it always, especially during the hours of trials, when my people rejected me and condemned me and said, Crucify him, crucify him. I look up to heaven and prayed to my father and said, Merciful and loving father, your wish is that all men should be saved. Kindly look on your rejected and condemned son, who suffered many tortures and will suffer many tortures through the sins of your people. Look and see what sin has done to your only begotten son. I offer all people who are living in this ungodly and wicked days all the tortures, pains, rejections, and shame of your Son, Jesus Christ, to you. For faith to withstand trials and patience, to withstand long tortures, may they through the sufferings of your only Son fight to the end. Amen. Our Lord's torture, increase our faith. Precious blood of Jesus, save us. Amen. Prayer for Fallen Sheep and against the fall in faith. Jesus said, I envisage constant abandonment of faith in my people and how they will constantly reject their God and crucify me daily. The pains grew in intensity when I saw how hard it will be for them to return. Many there were who would stop on the way because they thought the way was too hard and too long. How large the number of my people who will lose hope and fall. I say to you, my children, wake up and stand firm. During my fall, I remember all these things and offer them to my Father. Through this prayer, through it, my Father will pour on you all the needed graces to endure until the end. All who pray it devotedly will possess the fullness of the Holy Spirit and learn to be obedient and humble. Eternal and loving Father, look kindly on your only begotten Son. See the heavy cross they prepared for your only Son and have mercy on your people. I offer you all the pains sufferings, and the precious blood of your Son, Jesus Christ, Emmanuel, for all your people who have abandoned their faith and will abandon their faith in the mountainous hills and deep valleys of this world. May they, through the falling of your Son under the cross, have strengthened to rise again and stand firm in the true faith. Through the ocean of his precious blood, dump under the cross, on the streets of Jerusalem, strengthen all who are eager to do your will. Amen. Precious blood of Jesus Christ, strengthen our weakened souls. Amen. Prayer for the reign of glory on earth. Jesus said, The manifestation of the red dragon and the Antichrist, in this last hour of this age, pierced my heart greatly during my ministry on earth, and even more when I was about to breathe my last on the cross. 
as I hang on the cross, I envisage the proud dragon. It boasted to reign on earth forever. I silently offered my father this prayer for the downfall of the enemy of the cross. My children, through this prayer, this Antichrist and the red dragon and his agents will have a short hour of reign on earth. The more you pray, the shorter the hour of their reign on earth. O loving and merciful Father, all-knowing and all-powerful, the Alpha and the Omega, the Eternal Father, who created all things, that you should forsake your children, your nature forbids. Look kindly on your begotten Son, Jesus Christ, who came to save men and bring your kingdom down on earth. We offer you all the agonies, tortures, pains, and the precious blood of your Son, Jesus Christ, for the defeat of all the enemies of the Holy Cross of Salvation. The Antichrist and the Red Dragon, who are fighting against the truth now and in the end of the age, may they through the precious blood of our Redeemer and His last breath on earth disappear like foam, exposed under the sun, so that your kingdom may quickly come on earth. Amen. Precious blood of Jesus Christ, thy kingdom come. Amen. Prayer against the sins of the flesh. Jesus said, Do you know that I was naked in the sight of all men, so that you shall defeat and kill the desires of the flesh, which led to this sin of fornication and adultery? Children, my adversary used this sin to claim all men to himself. Any sinner who constantly prays this prayer will gain true repentance. The more you pray it, the more many will return to me and leave fornication and adultery. Many people will be lost during to the sins of the flesh. Work hard to save souls. Holy and merciful Father, your only begotten Son, is standing naked in the sight of all men, so that your people will know and fear your holy law. Accept my humble prayer for all your people who are living under iniquity fornication and adultery that through all the shame and disgrace of your only begotten son you will touch their lives for repentance and save them may they through the precious blood of your son jesus christ which i plead to fall on their hearts gain repentance and be saved and through his shame Make them bold for repentance. Amen. Prayer for the Baptism of Aborted Babies Jesus said, Today, the blood of innocent children has filled heaven. Their number is too great, too great. The wrath of the Eternal Father is about to fall on mankind. Their blood disturbs my agonizing heart and increase my agony. Through this prayer, large number of innocent unborn babies will be saved. Pray it daily and make it known to the world. Anyone who teaches it will not be lost. Innocent souls in heaven will not let them become lost. I, with my love and mercy, will protect them from falling into mortal sin. Heavenly Father, your love is eternal. In your ocean of love, you saved the world through your only begotten Son, Jesus Christ. Now look at your only Son on the cross, who is constantly bleeding for love of his people, and forgive your world. Purify and baptize aborted children with the precious blood and water from the sacred side of your Son, who hang death on the cross for their salvation in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, may they through 
through the holy of Jesus Christ, gain everlasting life, through his wound be healed, and through his precious blood be freed, there to rejoice with the saints in heaven. Amen. Reparation Prayer for Sins Committed Against the Precious Blood Blessed Mary said, My children, let me explain to you how to pray and what heaven wants from you. My son listens to you always. He wants to hear from you always. Oh, my loving children, pray this prayer always at least 500 times a day. Most precious blood of Jesus Christ, save us and the whole world. Most precious blood of Jesus Christ, save us and the whole world. Most precious blood of Jesus Christ, save us and the whole world. Most precious blood of Jesus Christ, save us and the whole world. Most precious blood of Jesus Christ, save us and the whole world. Most precious blood of Jesus Christ, save us and the whole world. Most precious blood of Jesus Christ, save us and the whole world. Most precious blood of Jesus Christ, save us and the whole world. Most precious blood of Jesus Christ, save us and the whole world. Most precious blood of Jesus Christ, save us and the whole world. Most precious blood of Jesus Christ, save us and the whole world. Most precious blood of Jesus Christ, save us and the whole world. Jesus said, Children, I say there is no valuable thing in that place of pleasure and enjoyment. There is no valuable thing in that easy way of life. All the precious treasure, the treasures of heaven, are hidden in the thorny way of life. See, I chose the Calvary way, the way of sorrow, the bloody way, the full of pains and agony for your salvation. There is no other way of salvation. I found then the painful way of salvation. Do not reject the Calvary way. Though the way is painful, the end is full of happiness. Receive this. This is my blood, the blood of your redemption. Open your heart for my great seal. Have your seal now, so that you will not be dry. When you enter the desert of dryness, at that time, all of you who are sealed will be strengthened by my most precious blood. Their weak soul shall be courageous. Jesus